Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's stay in the UK is likely to be very short if they are invited to King Charles III's coronation, as an expert says they threaten to be a distracting sideshow. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex have been tipped to attend the ceremony but to be conspicuously absent from any engagement surrounding the event. This is the view of the Daily Express's royal correspondent Richard Palmer, who was speaking with Pandora Forsyth on our Royal Roundup earlier today. Discussing the question of whether the Sussexes will be invited to the coronation, he said he thinks a decision on that has not yet been taken. And he says that if they do get an invite it'll ultimately up to them whether they attend or not. No matter what they decide, Mr. Palmer said their role in the proceedings will be minimal if they to attend. He said, my guess remains that they will invite them. It will be a little bit of a sideshow, but it will be a sideshow whether they come or not. And Terry spin some reporting suggesting that the rest of the royal family are worried about them repeating private conversations if they do come. Well, I think they didn't have much time with other members of the family when they were here for Queen Elizabeth's Platinum Jubilee. I can well envisage a situation where they come back to the UK, stay at Frogmore Cottage, go to the coronation, don't appear on the balcony, don't appear at any other events involving working members of the royal family and then go back to the States. To me that seems the most likely scenario, but who can say for sure at the moment? It has been confirmed that King Charles III will follow in his mother's footsteps with a balcony appearance after his coronation, 70 years after he watched his mother be crowned Queen Elizabeth II. At her Platinum Jubilee balcony appearance last June, the late monarch ruled that only working royals would join her on the balcony. It is not yet known whether he will follow his mother's lead on this ruling too. Back in June 1953 he was only four years old when he stood on the balcony after his mother's coronation at Westminster Abbey. The then Prince Charles received a special hand-painted children's invitation to his mother's coronation. He was the first child to witness his mother's coronation as sovereign. His sister Anne was thought to be too young for the occasion so was not there with the rest of the family. But she did join them on the balcony where she stood at the front with her brother 